OpenAI has announced a completely new model series called O1, containing the O1 Preview model and the O1 Mini model for ChatGPT. This new model is not a basic GPT but is created specifically to handle more complex tasks. But is the O1 model suitable for daily users? For what kind of tasks are they going to be used? And what are the main differences between the O1 Preview and the O1 Mini? Let's find out. The new ChatGPT model, named the O1 series, is designed to think more deeply before responding, enabling it to handle complex tasks more effectively. This advancement allows these models to tackle harder problems in areas like science, coding, and math, performing better than previous models in those domains. The key feature of the O1 series is its enhanced ability to reason. Through extensive training, these models have learned to take their time with difficult problems, refine their thought processes, experiment with different strategies, and identify mistakes. This deliberate thinking process mimics how humans approach challenging tasks. Let's take a simple example to understand how the O1 model stacks up against the older 4O model. Imagine asking both models this question. Assume the laws of physics on Earth. A small strawberry is put into a cup, and the cup is placed upside down on a table. Someone then takes the cup and puts it inside a microwave. Where is the strawberry now? Explain your reasoning step by step. When we ask the 40 model, it tries to explain its reasoning. But the answer is incorrect. Now, when we ask the O1 model the same question, first it thinks before answering, then it replies with more detail, but more importantly, the answer is correct. In performance tests, the O1 model has shown impressive results performing at a level comparable to PhD students on difficult benchmarks in physics, chemistry, and biology. The model also excels in math and coding tasks, scoring significantly higher than previous models. For example, while GPT-4 solved only 13% of problems in the International Mathematics Olympiad IMO, qualifying exam, the O1 model solved 83% of them. While this early release of the O1 series lacks some practical features like web browsing or file and image uploads, it represents a major step forward for complex reasoning tasks. This marks a new era of AI capability, and OpenAI has chosen to reset the version numbering to O1 to signify this leap in performance. Now let's talk about the main features of O1 Preview and O1 Mini. The O1 Preview model is designed to give users access to the next generation of AI capabilities. It includes improvements like better handling of complex reasoning tasks and more context-aware responses. According to the official documentation, the O1 Preview is more powerful, with an increased ability to handle nuanced questions and deliver high-quality answers. One of the standout features is the ability to solve more complex, multi-step problems effectively. This makes the O1 Preview ideal for users who need precise and in-depth answers quickly. The O1 Mini, on the other hand, is the cost-efficient sibling of the O1 Preview. It's designed for tasks that require fewer resources while still delivering quality results. This makes it perfect for more lightweight applications where you don't need all the power of the O1 Preview. The O1 Preview is great for users who need advanced capabilities. Think researchers, developers working on complex projects, or businesses looking for precise solutions. And the O1 Mini is for those who need effective AI but are focused on cost efficiency, such as content creators, small businesses, and those with routine AI tasks. To get started with ChatGPT01, you can simply head over to OpenAI's website and sign up for access. The interface is similar to previous versions, so if you've used models like ChatGPT 4.0, you'll feel no difference. You can type your prompts just like you do with the other models. According to OpenAI, the O1 series is just the beginning of a new generation of models. They are working on continuous improvements to make these models even better at handling complex reasoning and adapting to different use cases. To sum it all up, the O1 model is a huge step forward compared to the 4O model. It's more powerful, more efficient, and offers flexibility with the O1 Mini. 
If you want to learn more about ChatGPT and similar AI tools, make sure to check out the playlist next. Thanks for watching and see you in the next video.